Aloha and welcome to Mrs. Mommy Martin. I am Rochelle. All right, here we go. This is my mini waffle maker. I bought it on Amazon. I'll, I'll um, include a link in my description below um, where you can buy it. Um, it's very inexpensive and it is probably the best thing to have um, for quick keto lunches or breakfasts and things like that. Today what I'm going to make with it is a cheese turkey sandwich and basically what it is is Mexican blend shredded cheese and then turkey breast, jalapenos and then more Mexican blend shredded cheese and then we we'll close the lid and then let it fry for about two to three minutes and you will see how beautiful and golden and crispy this wonderful cheese sandwich is. After I close it, I apply slight pressure just to get it even cooking and as flat as possible without it oozing out of the sides. You can see that the oil um, from the cheese is kind of oozing out the sides which is why it is so important to put a plate underneath your mini waffle maker it catches all the stuff that overflows makes cleanup so much easier so after about two to two and a half minutes you can see how crispy the top is. Um, it's okay if the sides look like that because it just means that the sides were lower. And so you just kind of carefully pull it up and it's nice thick and it's beautiful and crispy and brown. And I'm just going to make one more and I'll show you the sauce that I make with mine. So basically, the sauce that I make for my little cheese turkey sandwiches consists of mayonnaise, mustard, and ranch powder, which all have zero carbs, so it's pretty safe for a keto diet. So I just kind of put, um, I don't know, maybe about one and a half to two tablespoons of mayonnaise, about... Um, a teaspoon of mustard. Mustard is pretty strong, so we just put a little bit, um, maybe half a teaspoon of mustard. And I just kind of eyeball how much powder to put in there depending on how much seasoning I want. Um, the powder is zero calories, zero carbs, zero sugar, zero everything. So I just mix it up and that is what I smear on top of my sandwich. So my second one is done and it looks good to me. Let me just check the underneath. You just pull it up and boom, that is gorgeous. It's this golden brown. It's already crispy and as it cools off, it gets even more crispy. It's wonderful. All right, you guys. So this is the end result. Look at how crispy it is. And inside there's turkey and jalapenos and cheese. You could literally 
use these two um, things as burger buns. I kid you not, if you had bacon in the center of these, holy moly, bacon bits. Um, but if you put a cheeseburger and put this and this on top, put lettuce inside and some pickles. Oh my God, so good. You could also put pickles in the center of this and make fried pickles. So what I am going to do though, I'll take one. And I had showed you that mixture that I made with mustard, mayonnaise, and ranch powder. And I'm going to just put it on there like that. Like that because it is like eating a sandwich. And what do you put in sandwiches? Mustard and mayonnaise and turkey. It's a sandwich by bread. There's cheese, turkey, mustard, mayonnaise, and jalapenos. Huh. It's crunchy. It's good. This is probably my favorite go-to meal. As a lunch, I'm eating it as my breakfast. As you can see, I'm staying pajamas. <laughs> but I want you guys to see that turkey, jalapeno, and cheese. <clears throat> super simple, super easy. Get yourself a mini waffle maker if you're doing keto, because this whole hack with the cheese, you can do so many things, make so many things. You can just do plain cheese. <clears throat> if nothing else, make these and use them as burger buns. Mm, so good. Maybe that's what I'll do for dinner tonight. these and use it as burger buns. For me, <clears throat> I would put jalapenos and bacon bits in the center and use them as burger buns. You can do whatever you want. Yeah. Enjoy. Follow me for more easy recipes. I'll be posting um, quick recipes like this for a keto lifestyle and some snacks and all that, you can check out my video. I'll put it right there. Uh, keto snacks from a gas station. And look forward to more guys. Subscribe. <laughs>